Clayton Kershaw pitching game five of the World Series facing Randy Arozarena. This is bottom of first full count. Randy takes a slider, clubs it to left. Look at this. Almost out of here. Just to the left of the foul pole. And then Willie Adamas trying to do his best Carlton Fist to keep it fair. Doesn't work. And Clayton pitched an absolutely great game. And here he is a couple pitches later. Gets a Rosarina to ground into the 6-4-3 double play. Then later on the game, Rosarina is back on the bases. He's going to try to steal. This is one of my favorite teams. Strike him out. Throw him out. Strikes out Lau. And then gets a Rosarina at second base. And at first, Rosarina is like, no, 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 I was in. So they make the phone call. Let's look at it again. Just horrible swing by Lau. He's out. And then right here, we'll freeze it. He just gets a little bit of Rosarina right there before his hand touches the base. Super close play. Then perhaps a play of the game, Manuel Margot at third. Kershaw in the set position. Watch Margot. Takes off. Goes to home. Gets him. Great bang-bang play. Now Kershaw had to step off the rubber to avoid a balk. And watch how he does it. He's in his set position. Right there. Margot takes off. Steps off. Throws it to home. Close play now. Let's watch it again because that is a fabulous play. And Kershaw even said that he actually practices this because a lot of players try to steal on him at third. And here's a play at the plate. From this angle, you can see Margot's hand getting in right there. And it looks like Barnes only touched the helmet. But that's just from that camera angle because you know baseball. They're going to have three or four camera angles on this. So it looks like he's safe there. And then let's look at it from a different angle. From above, this one's hard because Barnes is kind of blocking and you can see right about there is where Margot touched the play, but you can't really see anything because Barnes is in the way. So that's not really a good angle. Now the best angle is this. You can see when Barnes puts his hand down, he hits Margot's glove. And you can see his kind of wrist move. And that's where he actually gets him. So great play. Interesting note on Kershaw. He has a big glove and holds it like this on purpose. So you can't see him move his hand around for pitch selection. Smart. And then here's Zunino striking out. Kershaw went five and two thirds innings. Two and runs, six Ks to help the Dodgers win game five. And, you know, he's had a tough time in the playoffs, but his last two starts have been phenomenal. And then here's a Rosarina crushing one to Turner at third. Turner making a great play, one bouncer to Muncie. And you might be talking about an MVP here with Turner. He's had a great series, and defensively and offensively. And Kershaw, you know, on top of that, also had a great series. You might be looking at him as possible MVP. And look at his curveball, 66 inches. This thing will drop. It's just an incredible pitch. Now, here's how his curveball looks. It comes at different angles. can go high or low, depending on the spin rate he puts on it. But the legend grows with Kershaw. Great pitch, game five for Kersh.